Hi everybody and welcome to a new series called Space Engineers and before we get started thank you very much to Sidfu1 for buying me the game and we've tried to do several little episodes of these I'm not happy with it I've had some help from a couple of the guys that uh, play this and so we're going to start off um, a new series and we're still going to call it season one because we haven't actually released any of this yet and we're going to um, see what we can do we're going to like what they suggest or learn it so let's get on with it shall we so let's go to um, new world we're going to do custom world okay <coughs> now we're going to do lone survivor but we're going to keep the safe environment so that means there's no um bit to um you know kind of <coughs> damage our, our, our base okay so um or do we go with the easy start i We're going to call this season one. Okay. We're going to call this season one. Yeah. <coughs> and we're going to have safe. Um, we're not too sure on this what normal one is. So it should be safe on this. Let's have a look at the easy. It doesn't seem to me. Start on an asteroid platform with one large ship and two small ships. Start in a green asteroid station with several large ships and small ships. This is a large scene. Well, we won't be doing that. Start on an abandoned asteroid platform with no ships. You have to start from scratch. I, I really do want to go with this one. Uh, crashed red ship and competitive 2 team multiplayer world. So we're going to do the lone survivor. This is what um, I believe but we're going to keep it on the safe mode okay and we're going to say okay <coughs> now Leonardo da Vinci says where there is shouting there is no true knowledge I actually agree with that because if you shout you're trying to get hurt you're not getting your opinion across and if you hear me heavy breathing today, it's um, due to the fact that I've been ill, my asthma is playing me up, and um, I, I just couldn't do it yesterday, so <coughs> yeah, excuse the heavy, heavy breathing and uh, coughing and stuff like that. So we know from the last few times that we've tried to play this uh, one or two of the guys said use the GPS which we're going to use the GPS hopefully we're not going to have no meteorite showers or anything like that um, we're going to build our base into the big asteroid and hopefully we can get a safe kind of environment in there um, until we kind of uh, find out what's going on so there's, there, there's a couple of things that we have learned. We know how to uh, heal ourselves now. We know how to make oxygen. I think we know how to fix the batteries when we're on, on low batteries. Uh, but we do know that if we die and we go into one of the ships, we lose all, all our GPS. So if we find a good asteroid and stuff like that, we need to have power on there with a, a uh, beacon. Now the hardest thing to find for us to start off with is uranium. So we'll also be turning off our manufacturing plant when we don't need it because we only have a little bit of uranium and that is really going to be one of the first things that we've got to be looking for is uranium, is power. Because if we don't have power, it's game over. It's, it's that simple as that. So first things first, welcome to, to season one. 
you can see that the base loan survivor icon is there up at the top yeah and we're going to go to g straight away we're going to go to character tools we're going to get rid of these we don't want these okay and we want uh these instead okay those are the first things that uh, we're going to be using now the next thing that we're going to be doing uh on here is we are going to uh, go to information we're going to go to GP, GPS we're going to do new from current position and we're going to put home base okay and that's it because what that will do now uh, when we when we move anywhere yeah you can see home base is in blue now base loan survivor is in green and when we turn off or i think we can turn it off from here uh control panel no we can't turn anything off from there so what we can do is go to the control panel here and press k <coughs> and is that control panel no terminal production info okay so we can show distance for friendly antennas and we can go say right we we just want um we'll, we'll go we'll go 25 meters okay and enemy antennas i only want to i, I want to double that uh just to 50 meters and show distance for owned antennas we're going to put down as well to uh, 50, if I can get it 50 meters okay um, that's it factions we don't do do non comms GPS we've got that okay so here we go so now do we can we sit so what we can do now you see is I believe we can go to the um, hopefully we haven't crashed uh, we I believe we can go to the reactor here um, we can <coughs> More reactor yeah not too sure about what we could do on there but you can see that only on here we have a mass of 0 0.37 kilograms so the first thing that we do need to do is go and find uranium now I don't know how uh, currently how at the moment we turn everything off but if we go over to here and we use T that fixes our energy and our oxygen okay um, I'm not I'm sure there is a way So we can toggle this off. That's one kilowatt. Small reactor. So that's just turned everything off for us so we actually do not use or waste any uh, bits so we're going to go and investigate our asteroid now we've got iron around we can see that we've got iron now I'm 
hoping this black is this black rock. Yes, this this is what we want. This is uranium. Now, what we want with this nice nice uranium, because that's going to give us a lot of power, is we want to dig in a nice straight line. But the problem being is, you can guarantee that this uranium is going to go off um, towards space. So. I think we're going to put our power back on because we found a lot of nice stuff. Yeah, and got a very good start base here. So we'll just click on uh, one of these and press K. And we'll go to the control panel and we'll put the uh, small reactor we'll put that back on now okay so that's going to put everything on for us we'll turn the jetpack off i think it was uh what was it z nope x there we go and <clears throat> because we know where our bit is what i want to try and do is find a nice level place which is basically going to be here I want to drill straight through to the uranium because that's going to be the most important bit for us So we've got a little bit of iron here, so you can see all, all of this iron here for us is going to be good. But there's no way for us to uh, store this iron because we don't have small cargo holds. So we're going to, um, I think we're going to risk it. We've got enough uranium around here. If we keep sort of level-ish, yeah and sort of trying to keep the rotation is it is it e or is it q we keep kind of q like that yeah and then we'll keep that rotation there so we can then hopefully we can go down And that there, we can start doing <coughs> a uranium entrance here, and hopefully that won't fly off. We, we don't know what uh, uranium is like here so we've got iron ore here at the moment so hopefully this is whoops gonna be our uranium now I know all you all you guys can see is black screen Did we pick up any uranium from here? Whoa. Okay, let's get dampness off. Do we get here uranium so we did get uranium there but it's kind of uh, going out of the base there whoops that was on yeah it gets a little bit um 
kind of scary when you kind of do that. So we're kind of at the wrong angle for this, but we just need some uranium. So I think we might as well just go in and get what we can. And if we need be, we'll just go chase it down. Just like so. How much have we got? Uranium 268. I'll fly back out. Now we can see that we're starting to catch it just a little bit. don't want to come so we'll just go back to home base now we've got like I said we've got a little bit of uranium uh, let's see what we've got we've got 494 bits there so hopefully now because we want to learn a little bit so we kind of rotate this way come on don't don't freeze on me don't freeze on me There we go. Right, so we're now going to uh, open the assembler and we're going to put in the uh, first one bit we're, we're going to be putting that on. That is our most, most important thing to do. <coughs> because if we don't have power, we don't have, uh, what's the name? I'm not sure if we can add that. Can we add that? I don't think we can. And we'll put in the ore as well. We now can go and start picking up this this ball. Okay, because again, this is valuable to us. Inventory full. So we know that we're going to be doing a lot of walking to start off with. So it might be nice to get a conveyor belt and stuff like that. Got 900 there. <coughs> so at least we can make our way through the all. But before we do that, I want to go and have a look. and see what uh, production there is for us for a small uh, cargo container. Now, this is small cargo, so we need silicon and nickel. Um, <clears throat> but what about conveyor belts, batteries, large cargo container, burn, yeah. Small conveyor, iron and nickel, so. What, what's this? This is a collector. Uh, conveyor 
frame conveyor conveyor tube so it definitely looks like we need nickel um what's this drill yeah so <coughs> We've actually got a nice section here. It's just that we just don't have um, bits and pieces. I don't know if there's any lighting or anything we can have in here. Inventory full. It's a shame we just do not have a cargo container. You know that would have been a nice thing to start off with, but I honestly don't mind that um, that's another hundred there let's have a look at production is there any light any lights Interior pillar, okay. ramp, stairs, catwalk, windows, windows. Nickel, jump drive, interior light. Yes, there is. So that's going to be really, really good for us because I'm hoping we can just shove that as we as we dig. We can put down some uh, floors and we can have a look at this merge block. Okay, medical room, landing gear, Gatling turret. We definitely want to get this if we can find silicon to power to the base. That will help us tremendously. Inventory full. Right, so. sure how long this uranium is going to take to uh, make we're not sure how much this has so volume can only take a certain amount of time um, why don't we get rid of this and we do that there <clears throat> let's get some of some of these made Okay, so let's put the uranium back. Will that now carry on making the uranium there? Yes, yeah, so that will be put there. So we'll take those. Um, no, actually, actually, I think we leave those in there. Now we go to production. we don't leave those in there do we so we take these out production or do yeah. okay we'll put those in there leave those in there we'll, we'll get this worked out production so I want the um Small blocks. No, large blocks. 
Right, I want the interior light. Right, okay, so there we go. Right, so that means we've got the construction component to make the interior light. And I want some... What is it? Steel catwalk? Are they going to be okay? Steel catwalk plate. Try... Ooh. Not too sure about that. It gave me so many, I only clicked on it once, so I didn't want it. did the wrong thing with the catwalk. I think we did the wrong thing with the catwalk. What if we what if we disassemble? All of those and disassemble all of those. So we'll make steel plate. Okay, so we've got to get rid of that. And assemble that. Alright, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Get that done. Right, so we now go to the Inventory. So I want that and I want that. Now, parts. I want, um, let's do L I G H T. So I want a light there. Yeah. So how do we construct it? Oh, I see. I see. So we do that, do we? Right, so. Can we put that on a wall or does it have to go. Can it go on here? Or is it got to be on the wall? Right, okay. It looks like it can't go there. Doesn't look like it can go there either, so. We'll have a look at still play. So G S T E So steel plate Steel catwalk plate steel catwalk corner catwalk two sides catwalk Okay what about plate That's still catwalk plate Didn't want that one Armor blocks that still plate 
Okay, can we have that anywhere? Can we put that? So, looks like we've got to, what is it, dig deeper? Right, so it looks like we might have to um, kind of just dig a bit deeper. So we will be back very shortly and we will see you on the bounce when we'll do another episode of, Fort of uh, Space Engineers and we'll work out see if we can put any lights separately or see what we have to do have fun stay safe and we'll see you on the bounce